I just took the biggest risk of my life. This year, I got a Coachella ticket, but didn't have a place to stay. So my plan, just like I've done successfully before, I'll be asking millionaires at Coachella if I can stay with them. Hi, can I stay with you just for Coachella? No. Bruh. This was brutal because it was so hot outside. No. I was now wondering once again if the word yes even still existed. No. Absolutely not. Until this house. Can I stay with you for Coachella weekend? Is that a yes? I think so. Bruh. Voldemort's house was actually very nice. And there was lots of fun activities to do. It had a basketball court, a golf course. It even had a pool. Shout out Voldemort, because this was the best weekend ever. I can't believe nobody noticed. I was able to fake my way into getting service at a restaurant wearing no shirt and no shoes. Bruh. So today, I'm gonna see if I can get service with no pants. Yup, you heard me right. Bruh. The plan was simple. I reached out to a professional body paint artist and she gave me specific instructions to pull this off. After hours of being a professional mannequin and $30,000 later, Bruh. it really looked like I was wearing pants. Let's see if this works. So far, so good. I ate at the restaurant and nobody noticed that my pants were painted on. It actually worked and I had no problem. The world record for the longest kiss is 58 hours. And today, we're gonna break that. Since I finally have a girlfriend, I was ready to take on this challenge and become the next world record holder. Everything was going perfect until we got hungry. It then became very obvious there was no way to drive and go get food like this. So we had our friend give us a ride. It was a little awkward, Bruh. but we managed to get through it. We got to the restaurant and then ordered. But then we faced our next obstacle. How can we eat? Bruh. So we just got a milkshake instead. So after this, we decided to go to the mall and do some shopping. And everybody and they mama was staring at us. Bruh. And after walking around for what felt like forever, I got a call from my friends. They really wanted to go ice skating, and my girlfriend wasn't too happy about that. So I promised her I would get her some flowers after. <laughs> Which probably wasn't the best idea. Bruh. My girlfriend Hannah has been acting really suspicious recently, and I think she might be cheating on me. So I am going to use this air tag to track her. As the day went on, I paid attention to her location and then realized she was at another guy's house. I'm gonna have a word with this guy. Turns out, it was her grandpa's house. <laughs> Oops. Bruh. But as I kept looking at where she was going, I still had a feeling that I couldn't trust her. As the day went on, her location changed to five guys? There is no way I am letting my girlfriend hang out with multiple boys. Once I got to the location, I realized it was just the restaurant. Bruh. But I still had a weird feeling. And that's when I saw she was headed to the park. So I had to see what was going on. And I saw her writing a letter. It had to be to her secret lover. And as she was leaving, Leaving, she dropped the letter and didn't even notice. It was finally time to catch her. The letter read, Dear Topper, I'm so sorry, but I have terrible news to confess. If everyone watching likes and subscribes, I'll tell you the truth. I can't believe they didn't notice. My dad and I have been coming to this restaurant for as long as I can remember. And honestly, this place almost feels like home. But it's missing something. And that's when it hit us. All homes have family photos on the wall. But this one Bruh. doesn't. So my dad and I paid a professional photographer $10,000 to take a beautiful photo of us. We then rushed to a photo printing lab and got the photo put on a beautiful canvas. We then went back to our usual spot, snuck in the photo, and did what we had to do. This place now really does feel like home. I'm the first YouTuber to get their own official drink at Starbucks. The other day I ordered at Starbucks and they told me that this was my 10,000th drink order, which puts me in their top 100 customers in the world. Perfect. Bro. I've tried every syrup, every type of milk, every topping. I even call myself the Starbucks king Bro. and I have confidence that this is the best drink ever. So I emailed Starbucks to see if they would give me my own drink on the menu. And after waiting what felt like forever, I got an email and it read, Dear Topper, we would love to give you your own drink at Starbucks, but you must have 20 million subscribers first. Subscribe! Three, two, one. Okay, bro. Yo, you think you can do that blindfolded? Easy. Okay, ready? Here we go. Here, throw this on. Come on. You know who I am, bro? Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh my god, right! Bro, that's already so impressive. Too easy. Make it go faster. You want it faster? Alright, ready? Yeah. I'm gonna hit it. Let's go. Oh my god, go! Oh my, bro, this is insane! Let's go. Woo! Oh, oh, bro, that was a close one! Oh my god! Crazy! <laughs> As you guys know, I love McDonald's. 
But the other day, I was wondering, is it possible to just order a slice of cheese? Well, there's only one way to find out. So I tried to do it online. Yes, American cheese, no meat, no salt, no Big Mac bun, and we should be good to go. They just canceled my order. <sighs> Attempt number one failed. But then I thought of another idea, the drive-thru. I ordered a Big Mac, but asked for nothing but cheese. I think this might have worked. I opened the box and found grilled cheese. Bruh. I had to step this up and head inside of McDonald's. I tried the machine that was inside of the store and took everything off the burger except for the cheese. After ordering, the workers literally called me over to make sure that they had the order right. I then got the order, opened the box, and it worked! I'm about to break a world record. This is one basketball, and this is ten. The ten ball, thirty pointer. This was my first attempt. The balls weigh over 50 pounds and stand at over eight feet tall. There's no way I could give up on this challenge. I was prepared to be here all day, Bruh. all night, however long it would take. The one thing I knew is that I was going to be a world record holder. I don't care if I'm 80 by the time I'm done here. Bruh. This was my 20th attempt. I kept trying and trying and trying. And on my last shot, if I make this, everyone has to subscribe. Oh, no, that has to count. This was a dumb idea. Today, my goal is simple, to break the law and get arrested. Why? Because the other day, I saw the most beautiful girl to walk this earth, and she was a police officer. Yeah. Obviously, I asked for her number. <laughs> it's 911. But there's no way I was gonna give up just yet. And that's when I realized, the only way she was gonna give me the time of day was if I got arrested. I waited for her to check me out, and Jay walked over to her. I just jaywalked. Time to arrest me. Honey, I don't arrest for jaywalking, but uh, here's a ticket. It was time to step up my game even more. It's illegal to park within 10 feet of a fire hydrant. So I made my next move. No, looks like you still have space. Are you serious? I have to figure this out. So as I was drinking water, I purposely littered. Yes, yes, it's totally working. I'm gonna need some backup. Backup? Hey, 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 what are you doing? No, no, I picked it up. And that is why. This was the worst celebration ever. The other day, I decided to throw myself a 16 million subscriber party. I started by making these invitations and mailing them out to all my friends. And then I went to the store to get all my favorite decorations for the party. This was gonna be lit. I needed everything to be perfect. Once I purchased all the decorations, I rented out the largest mansion I could find for my epic party. And then I started setting up. Everything was coming together so nicely. Now it was just time to wait for all my friends to show up and join the party. They had to be here any second. <laughs> Three hours went by and I was starting to rethink if anyone actually likes me. And I was starting to feel hopeless until my best friend showed up. It was a loser. <laughs> and that's why. Make me cry with a hundred dollars. Once I was two and I came back from my dad's and then like my pet fish died and they had to flush him down the toilet. Bruh. Your videos, like every time I watch them, they make my day. I'm I, subscribed. You're subscribed? You're not gonna make me cry, but here's $20. Make me cry and win $100. You're never gonna hit 20 million subscribers on YouTube. <laughs> you know, here, just take the money. Bruh. Dude, why does everybody say that?
gosh. Oh my gosh. Hurry! Okay, ready? Okay, ready on the count of three. What am I doing? What ready? Am I doing? One, go! Right. Just grab it. One, two, three. Right, baby, I'm gonna hit this golf ball over the house and I'm gonna catch it before it hits the ground. Topper, you're not that fast. Come on, baby, I got this. Oh you ready? my gosh. Here we go. Oh my god. Come on, baby. Oh, oh my gosh. Gate. Where did it go? Where did it land? Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, yeah, those were so expensive. Oh I spent god. every Dude, dime on those. So nice. They were expensive. Very. They smell good too. What? Wait, let me see. Oh my god! Gross topper! That is baby, disgusting! Baby, 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 baby! Topper, don't talk to me. I'm so mad at you. Baby, guess the number one through five, and if you get it, I'll give you ten thousand dollars. Are you serious? Yeah, baby, come on, you got this. Um five. What? Yeah, it's five. Wait, baby, are, are you sure? Yeah. Yeah, it, it has to be five. Oh my gosh, baby, you got it. Oh my god, I did it! Baby, how oh did my god, yes! Baby, how did you get wait, 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 baby? You cheated! Oh my baby, god, get, god. Back, get back here! Bro, it's gonna hit you, bro. Tell him top move. Bro, it didn't hit you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You wanna try? Oh, yeah, give me a try. Give me a try. Alright, ready? Me. Take a seat. Alright, grab the ball. Hold it up to the tip of your nose and release it. Tell me what you think. Oh, oh! Baby, your ice cream's ready. Really? Oh, thank you, babe. I think I did really good. Uh -huh. Check that out. Here, give it a taste. Oh, my favorite flavor. Do you like it? Yeah. Here, take a bite. One more comment about my hair. You know what? No, no, no. I'm done. I'm done. You guys want my hair gone? Fine. Well, here it all is. There goes all my hair. So if I see one more comment telling me I look homeless because of my hair, I'm going to lose it. I'm so done with I'm on my way. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Dude, you just the whole thing. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my. You guys, I'm so sorry. Here, you guys want to help me yeah, pick yeah, it up? Yeah, got, got you. Got you. You guys can just put it all in here. And thank you guys for helping me pick it up. Because if you guys if you guys actually look right here, I'm actually recording a video for TikTok. No, no way. And it's actually an honesty experiment. And since you guys were honest, I want you guys to keep this. This is like sixty thousand dollars. You kidding? I swear. No. I swear. So this is all for you guys. You guys can even take the, the case with it. Oh my god, you you can't. So you guys, all this money is are you sure? I swear, hundred percent that's for you guys. Absolutely. Of course, boy. 